हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स येट एन अदर शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स टू मल्टीप्लाई नंबर्स वेरी वेरी क्विकली इन द माइंड यस मेंटल मैथमेटिक्स ट्रिक्स यू नो दे आर यूज्ड टू कैलकुलेट टेन टाइम्स फास्टर एंड यू नीड टू बी रियली रियली स्मार्ट विद नंबर्स इफ यू वॉन्ट टू क्रैक द कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स एंड डू ऑल दोज बेसिक कैलकुलेशन रियली क्विकली so friends today in this video i am going to tell you how to multiply some special numbers which are ending in 3 yes the numbers which we are going to multiply both the numbers are going to end in 3 and you will see how vedic maths will help you a great deal in you know increasing your speed of multiplying the numbers and obviously the higher calculations also become so easy when you are good in your basic calculations so before i get into the technical details of the trick let me just tell you that if you want the compilation of all these tricks you know which i have been posting on the channel you need to go for this amazing short tricks for quantitative aptitude ebook and look at the number of exams it targets whether you are a school student or a college student or anybody who is preparing for government competitive exams this short trick ebook is for you it is one of its kind ebook and it contains 24 different chapters covering over 300 short tricks and you know obviously 10 times faster calculation speed is targeted uh, it comes with a reasoning course combo and uh, you know uh, 18 chapters covered in that covered in that also and we have some videos also in the reasoning course so what are you waiting for send me a message on whatsapp here is the whatsapp number 9896 Three six double nine six three now, right, friends. So here is the trick, and here we have some special numbers which I am going to take up, and all these numbers are going to end in three. So the first example which I am taking up is that of forty three times ninety three. Now look at these two numbers, forty three and ninety three. The unit digits are obviously three and three, right? So apart from the threes, you have four here. And nine here, so you will be doing four times nine on the left, and three times three that is nine on the right. In the middle, because it is ending in three, so you will be doing three times something. And what is that something? The sum of four and nine. That is thirteen. Nine plus four is thirteen. So what is the trick here? Product. Product of the numbers other than the threes. Then three times. the sum s and then the 9 now this is the trick which i am going to use in the uh, video and i am going to show you how big numbers can also be multiplied like this so 9 fours are 36 and then we have 13 threes are 39 and then 9 so retain the 9 is the answer 39 means 9 is the answer and 3 gets carried forward so 36 plus 3 is 39 and here is your answer for the question 43 times 93 is 3 Nine nine nine. You can pick up the calculators and check and apply it to bigger numbers as well. Let's take an example of seventy-three, a two-digit number, and maybe a one twenty-three, which is a three-digit number. And you will see the trick still works. Here we have seven apart from the three. Here you have twelve apart from the three. So I am going to do seven into twelve, and then I am going to do three times seven plus twelve, the sum. And finally, we have the nine. So twelve sevens are eighty-four, and then this is nineteen. Threes are fifty-seven, and then the nine. So the nine is retained. Fifty-seven means seven retained. Five gets carried forward. So eighty-four plus five is eighty-nine. And see, now the speed of calculation has doubled because I am not explaining all the steps. Once you are aware of the steps, you can certainly work on your speed also. Likewise. Two digit by two digit, two digit by three digit. How about taking big numbers? Uh, okay, let's take one more example of a two digit by three digit, so that you know we are more comfortable uh, with the application part of the trick. Okay, so let's take eighty three and one seventy three. Now there is eight and seventeen here, so seventeen times eight. This is what I need to do first. Eight sevens are fifty six, and then thirteen, right? One thirty six. So I have to write one thirty six. And then three times what? The sum of eight and seventeen, which is twenty-five, and finally the nine. So one thirty-six, then seventy-five, 
and then 9. So 9, 5 and the 7 add, uh, gets added to 136 makes it 143 and now check using the calculator 83 times 173 is that 14359 and you will be really really surprised that the answers are very very accurate. Now see how much time this, uh, did this calculation take? I think 30 to 40 seconds right? And it's in itself, it is a, a, an amazing speed of calculations, you know, and it saves you uh, uh, the, you know, risk of uh, making mistakes in the traditional multiplication. So let's apply this to some bigger numbers. Let's have a question where we have a three digit number like 163 and I want to multiply that by 244. Now I know that I have to do 16 times 24. So I'll be using basic maths. 16 and 24, so 6 4s are 24, 4 2 carry, then cross multiply 12 and 4 16, 16 plus 2 18, 8 1 carry and then 1 2s are 2 plus 1 3. So we have 384 as the product, then 3 times what? The sum, 16 plus 24, that's pretty easy, 40 and finally the 9. So we have 384 and then 40 times 3 is 120 and then the 9. So 9, 120 means 0, 12 gets added here, this is 6, 9, 3 and 3, 9, 6, 0, 9 is the product. Likewise, if you increase the numbers like 363, see now the numbers are getting bigger and we need to multiply that by 583. So I'll do this and then I'm going to give you a DIY problem. Do it yourself problem. I want you to test yourself also, okay? Follow the steps which I am showing you here. Uh, find the answer to that. Note down the time. Tell me in the comments whether you got the correct answer or not and how much time did you take to multiply the numbers ending in 3 using this trick, okay? So before that, I need to do this, right? So I have a 36 here and a 58 here and the first thing I am going to do is to write them here and multiply them using the Vedic Maths method of vertically and crosswise. So 8, 6 are 48, 8, 4 carry. Now this is 24 and this is 30. 24 and 30 is 54. 54 plus 4, 58, 5 carry. And then this is 15 plus 5, 20. So 2, 0, 8, 8 is the product of 36 and 58. And I will write that as the number on the left. In the middle, 3 times what? 36 plus 58 is 80 and 14, 94 and finally the 9. So 2, 0, 8, 8 and then 3, 4 are, okay, this is 270 plus 12, right, 282 and the 9, so 9, 2 and the 28 gets carried forward here. So 8 plus 8, 16, 6, 1 carry, 11 means 1, 1 carry, 1 and then 2, 2, 1, 1, 6, 2, 9 is the product of these two numbers and now your turn you have to do 813 and multiply that by 443 so this is your diy question apply the same method which i have done here and let me know in the comments below whether this method is working for you or not and do tell me the time also okay so friends mathematics is wonderful and you have so many different tricks you know and I hope you are watching all these tricks which I have been posting on the channel and please take a while to share it with all your friends, your students, if you are a teacher, um, your colleagues, right? And uh, do not forget to subscribe the channel and click the bell shaped icon so that you keep on getting all the notifications, you know, of these useful uploads which I have been doing on the channel. Friends, thanks for watching this video. Look for some more amazing tricks to come in future also. All the best for the DIY question.